Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? Can't let him get away! Uh, Milo, I don't know if you've forgotten, but there are currently guards chasing us! Are you gonna help us or not here? I just hope I was right about you. Philippe? Right this way! This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. It can be difficult, it's true. Many items have to be snuck under the noses of guards. So you're thieves then? <sighs> If you want to get black and white about it, then yes, I suppose we sometimes need to resort to less than legal methods to get our materials. That's pretty harsh, Jesse. They're just stealing from the rich tyrants in charge. That's like good stealing. You see, one day a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden. So I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Jeez, that seems pretty harsh for such a tiny crime. Oh, but it's not, Tiny. I was charged with egregious wasting of resources, and in Sky City, that's one of the worst crimes of all. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone, forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas. Milo, your people are rebels, willing to fight the system. Will they help us save our friends? Why, I think they might. Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Yeah. I'm sorry to come barging in like this. We just really need your help. And we're going to give it to them, right, guys? These aren't just any outsiders. They're the ones who built that magnificent bridge into town today. What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo, are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn him in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. They say they're builders, I guess. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. Oh, come on, we don't have time for this. It'll be fine. You're one of the best builders I know. One of? We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from. You're gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, use them for your build. Okay, thanks. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn, I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Huh? <laughs> Getting nervous yet, Milo? <laughs> what? No, of course not. Oh, this day is going exactly as I hoped it would go when I got out of bed this morning. <laughs> Don't worry. <gasps> oh, wait, <mercy. gasps> 
Jesse! What is that thing? Is it... is... is it safe? Everyone! Everyone, please! It's not as bad as it looks! What? That monster! It, it wants to eat us! No, no, it won't hurt anyone! It's totally tame! I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah. Sorry, we're sorry. Please. I didn't do it to impress you. I did it because Milo promised to get us into the palace, and you guys wouldn't get off his back. Time to make good on your word, right, Milo? Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace. You help me steal the Eversource from my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! I'm overwhelmed at the thought. Okay, but my friends are in trouble in there. So if we're breaking into the palace, we're going to save them. This is an acceptable and noble arrangement. Good. Now, as for how to get into the palace, according to my informants, the Founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the Founder leaves guards at every door, but there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry, but it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Okay, so we'll just climb up. That doesn't seem too hard. You have not seen this wall. We have tried, but it is sheer steel blocks. No handholds. It means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Jesse, we will never forget this day. 